Did you know that you can convert ordinary fan AC motor into a power transformer? Hello Hectubers and welcome back to my channel Hectuber. Let's start the video with this AC motor which is a fan from a heater and I power up just letting you know that it's working motor that will be converted into a transformer. By removing all mechanic parts from the motor, example removing the rotor, with this step we make a space for winding my solid copper wire. I'm using around 10 meters of 1.3 mm copper wire diameter wire and this takes me around 2 hours to wind all the wire. It's hard but not impossible. Next step is making a isolation out of thin cardboard using two component glue to make solid base for the wire coil and making secondary coil output power. I am done with the second coil, this is the primary coil for input of AC 220 volts and that is the original coil from the motor and this is the secondary coil and this coil will give output AC voltage now I'm gonna test it. Ok, here I have my digital multimeter just to measure the voltage of input and output plug it in on these alligator clips we have a 220 volts AC 234 ok let's check the secondary coil how much volts it's giving AC volts 3.3 volts Okay, that is enough for the experiment, but, but this thing is giving AC voltage. What does it mean? It means that we need to convert it into DC voltage, direct current or alternate current. And this is 50 amp bridge rectifier. I will use this in my next project. You have a small bridge rectifier up to 1.5 amps but I'm, I'm using in this experiment this bridge rectifier ok I have already soldered an electrolytic capacitor of 100 1000 microfarads 16 volts right now I'm gonna solder the bridge rectifier 
to the output wires from the transformer. I'm done and now I have a positive and negative pole because this bridge rectifier convert the, the voltage from AC to DC and let's check it does it work power on the transformer let's see this way okay positive to positive Negative to negative. Oh, the wire is disordered. Working. Okay. So, from simple AC motor. I made a transformer from 220 volts down to 3 volts AC then through this bridge rectifier I convert AC to DC voltage and I that is given by the this power supply and how much 8.5 volts but it's not stabilized let's power on these piranha LEDs this goes here no alright yep it's working while the LEDs are turned on I'm gonna measure the voltage of today power supply and it says 2.9 volts DC okay now I'm gonna try these 60 plus LEDs all connected together nope this is the negative this is the positive and working okay now let's measure the voltage two point six volts okay from AC motor transformed or converted into a transformer that give AC voltage through the bridge rectifier I transform that AC to DC voltage and then to power up a small DC motor in this video I only wanted to show that you can make a transformer out of AC motor and it's working great Thank you for watching, please subscribe, see ya!